Austria's cabinet has approved ambitious plans to ban non-biodegradable plastic bags, following in the footsteps of France and Italy. According to the government, the ban would see a massive drop in the amount of plastic waste produced by the landlocked Alpine nation by between 5,000 and 7,000 tons annually. The new legislation passed by Austria's centre-right government on Wednesday is expected to be introduced at the beginning of 2020. Vienna also plans to ban the addition of tiny plastic particles to cosmetic and cleaning products if the European Union fails to come up with a solution for this issue before 2020. In October, European lawmakers backed an EU ban on single-use plastics from 2021. This includes single-use straws, plates, cutlery, stirrers and cotton buds, which the EU says makes up 70% of all marine litter. MEPs also added to this list products made of oxo-degradable plastics, such as bags or packaging and fast food containers made of expanded polystyrene. Scientists have proven that it takes a plastic carrier bag longer than other bags, which can cause irreversible damage wildlife. Share this article Share BBC Privacy Policy What other measures will be included in the proposed EU 2021 plastic ban? National reduction targets for other non-banned plastics The consumption of several other items, for which no alternative exists, will have to be reduced by member states by least 25% by 2025. This includes single-use burger boxes, sandwich boxes or food containers for fruits, vegetables, desserts or ice creams. Member states will draft national plans to encourage the use of products suitable for multiple use, as well as reusing and recycling. Other plastics, such as beverage bottles, will have to be collected separately and recycled at a rate of 90% by 2025. Cigarette bites and lost fishing GMOPs agreed that reduction measure should also cover waste from tobacco products, in particular cigarette filters containing plastic. It would have to be reduced by 50% by 2025 and 80% by 2030. One cigarette bud can pollute between 500 and 1,000 liters of water, and thrown on the roadway, it can take up to 12 years to disintegrate. They are the second most littered single-use plastic items. Member states should also ensure that at least 50% of lost or abandoned fishing gear containing plastic is collected per year, with a recycling target of at least 15% by 2025. Fishing gear represents 27% of waste found on Europe's beaches. Making producers more accountable, member states would have to ensure that tobacco companies cover the costs of waste collection for those products, including transport, treatment, and litter collection. The same goes for producers of fishing gear containing plastic, who will need to contribute to meeting the recycling target. Source, European Parliament Meanwhile, in England, large shops have been charging shoppers 5p for all single-use plastic carrier bags since 2015. Similar charges are also applicable in Scotland, Wales and Northern Ireland. The number of plastic bags used in England has sharply dropped by some 80% since the government introduced the charge. According to UK government data, over 7.6 billion single-use plastic bags were given to customers by major supermarkets in England in 2014, approximately 140 bags per person, or the equivalent of about 61,000 tons of plastic, 